Paul of Agina, Wikipedia article audio. Paul of Agina or Paulus Aegenita was a 7th century Byzantine Greek physician best known for writing the medical encyclopedia medical compendium in seven books. He is the father of early medical books. For many years in the Byzantine Empire, this work contained the sum of all Western medical knowledge and was unrivaled in its accuracy and completeness. Life Works Notes Nothing is known about his life, except that he was born in the island of Aegina, and that he traveled a good deal, visiting, among other places, Alexandria. He is sometimes called Iatrosophists and Periodots, a word which probably means a physician who traveled from place to place in the exercise of his profession. The exact time when he lived is not known, but, as he quotes Alexander of Trolleys, and is himself quoted by Yahya ibn Sarafiun, it is probable that Abu al-Faraj is correct in placing him in the latter half of the 7th century. The Sutta says he wrote several medical works, of which the principal one is still extant, with no exact title, but is commonly called Medical Compendium in Seven Books. This work is chiefly a compilation from earlier writers, indeed its Greek title proclaims that it is an epitome of medicine, epitomes iatrikes. William Alexander Greenhill wrote that his reputation in the Islamic world seems to have been very great, and it is said that he was especially consulted by midwives, whence he received the name of al kawabili or the Akushur. He is said by the Arabic writers to have written a work, De Muliarum Morbus, and another, De Puriolorum Vivendi Rationiat Curationi. His great work was translated into Arabic by Hunan ibn Ishaq. The sixth book on surgery in particular was referenced in Europe and the Arab world throughout the Middle Ages, and is of special interest for surgical history. The whole work in the original Greek was published in Venice in 1528, and another edition appeared in Basel in 1538. Several Latin translations were published. Its first full translation into English, was by Francis Adams in 1834. In this work he describes the operation to fix a hernia similar to modern techniques writing, after making the incision to the extent of three fingers breadth transversely across the tumor to the groin, and removing the membranes and fat and the peritoneum being exposed in the middle where it is raised up to a point, let the knob of the probe be applied by which the intestines will be pressed deep down. The prominence, then, of the peritoneum, formed on each side of the knob of the probe, are to be joined together by sutures, and then we extract the probe, neither cutting the peritoneum nor removing the testicle, nor anything else but curing it with applications used for fresh wounds.